Have you ever found yourself caught in the exhausting cycle of constantly vying for someone's attention, feeling like you're running in an endless race with no finish line in sight? Imagine a day where your peace of mind is no longer dictated by others' perceptions or validations, where your inner tranquility isn't disrupted by the relentless need to seek approval. That's where Stoicism steps in, a philosophy that offers a profound insight into personal relationships. Stoicism encourages us to focus more on our internal values and less on external factors, like the attention we receive from others. By embracing its principles, we can cultivate healthier relationships and discover true contentment from within. This video invites you to explore how Stoicism can transform the way you approach relationships helping you find balance and serenity without exhausting yourself for someone else's attention. Stay with us as we delve into this timeless philosophy and uncover its practical applications for modern life, making your journey towards self-improvement both enlightening and entertaining. Moving forward, let's dive into the fundamental principles of Stoicism, a philosophy that traces its origins back to ancient Greece. It was founded by Zeno of Citium in the early 3rd century BC, yet its timeless wisdom continues to resonate even today. Central figures such as Seneca, Epictetus, and the Roman Emperor Marcus Aurelius are often celebrated for their writings and teachings that have laid the foundation for Stoicism's core tenets. But what exactly do these teachings encompass? At its heart, Stoicism emphasizes the importance of rational thinking and emotional control. This philosophy teaches us that our perception of events, rather than the events themselves, is what truly influences our emotional state. By focusing on what we can control our thoughts, intentions, and actions, Stoicism guides us to live in harmony with both ourselves and the world around us. Imagine flipping through the pages of Marcus Aurelius's Meditations, where he reflects on personal wisdom and virtue, or envision Seneca writing about the importance of reason over impulse. These ancient texts offer profound insights into managing life's challenges with grace and equanimity. As we continue exploring Stoicism, Think of it not just as an ancient philosophy, but as a practical guide to improving our daily interactions and inner peace. With this understanding, we're well equipped to explore how these principles apply to our personal relationships in the modern world, providing us with tools to foster more meaningful connections without the constant pursuit for attention. Now turning to the nature of attention-seeking, let's explore the psychological and social aspects behind this instinctual behavior. Humans are inherently social beings, and with that comes the natural craving for validation from others. This desire stems from deep-rooted evolutionary instincts where social acceptance directly influenced survival. In today's context, seeking validation often manifests through the need for attention, a behavior that can significantly impact our personal well-being. Consider the story of a person who constantly checks their social media, yearning for likes and comments as a measure of self-worth. This scenario highlights how modern platforms amplify our attention-seeking behaviors, often leading to stress and anxiety when expectations aren't met. Studies have shown that excessive attention-seeking can lead to decreased self-esteem and increased feelings of loneliness, as the validation is often fleeting and superficial. Conversely, when individuals receive genuine, affirming attention, their emotional well-being can improve, illustrating the dual-edged nature of this behavior. By understanding why we seek attention, we can begin to address these tendencies constructively, aligning with Stoic philosophy's call for inner focus and self-control. As we delve further, we'll uncover how Stoicism offers strategies to manage these desires, nurturing healthier relationships and fostering a deeper sense of self-assurance. With the next phase of the journey in sight, we delve into the Stoic principle of self-control, a fundamental value that can transform our interactions and relationships in the realm of Stoicism, self-control is not just about restraint but the mastery of one's inner world. 
By keeping our emotions in check, we develop the ability to respond rather than react to external events and pressures. This control over our emotional responses fosters healthier and more balanced relationships. Consider the ancient Stoic philosopher Epictetus, who often emphasized the power of controlling what lies within our own mind. In a historical scenario, imagine a Roman leader faced with the betrayal of a close ally. Instead of succumbing to rage or making hasty decisions, he pauses, reflects, and chooses a response based on reason and principle, not impulse. This illustrates how self-control can lead to measured actions that maintain integrity and focus, even amidst turmoil. Similarly, in fictional narratives, characters who exhibit self-control often emerge as leaders displaying resilience and wisdom. Think of a modern-day story where an individual in a conflict chooses to listen and understand the opposing view rather than react with immediate anger. This choice can de-escalate tension and open pathways to resolution. Stoicism teaches us that nurturing self-control not only strengthens our personal relationships but aligns with a life of virtue and fulfillment. By embracing this principle, we equip ourselves to handle life's challenges with grace, fostering connections that are genuine and grounded in mutual respect. Moving forward, we delve into the stoic distinction between internal and external focus, a key principle that guides us to prioritize what truly matters. Stoicism teaches that by concentrating on our internal values and principles, we can lead more fulfilling lives, free from the constant clamor for external validation like attention or approval. To illustrate, picture someone as a gardener tending their inner garden. The internal focus is akin to nurturing the roots, ensuring that values such as integrity, honesty, and patience are strong and resilient. When these roots are healthy, the tree can withstand harsh weather, Conversely, an external focus is like obsessing over the outward appearance of the leaves, always seeking the sun's attention without tending to the roots. This can lead to a tree that looks lush momentarily but is vulnerable to the first storm. In our lives, external validations are akin to temporary weather conditions, ever-changing and beyond our control. By rooting ourselves in internal focus, we ensure our actions are guided by what we can control, our thoughts, intentions, and responses. This approach aligns with Stoic wisdom, encouraging us to remain steadfast regardless of external circumstances. The next time you find yourself seeking someone's attention or approval, remember the gardener analogy and choose to cultivate your internal garden. By doing so, you'll not only find peace and strength in your own values, but you'll also build a life less swayed by the fleeting whims of external judgments. As the sun rises on the next chapter, let these insights guide you towards deeper self-awareness and resilience in your relationships. As the sun rises on the next chapter, let us explore the significant role of patience within the teachings of Stoicism. Patience is more than just a virtue. It is a fundamental stoic practice that acts as a buffer against the chaos of life's unpredictable events. In relationships, patience allows us to remain calm, granting us the ability to navigate misunderstandings or disagreements without escalating into unnecessary conflicts. Picture a river that flows steadily regardless of the obstacles in its path. The river does not rush or force its way through. Instead, it calmly finds its course, illustrating how patience can help us maintain composure and perspective amidst turmoil. To cultivate patience, consider incorporating a few mindful practices into your daily routine. Begin with mindful breathing, focusing on the rhythm of your breath to center your thoughts and emotions. Practicing gratitude can also shift your perspective helping you appreciate the present moment without feeling rushed or anxious about what comes next. Another technique is to set aside a few minutes each day for reflection. Allow yourself to observe your thoughts without judgment, acknowledging any impatience that arises. This practice of self-awareness can lead to a profound understanding of the triggers that challenge your patience. 
By practicing patience, you nurture a more tranquil, resilient state of mind that aligns with stoic values, ultimately fostering healthier and more harmonious relationships. As we internalize these practices, we lay the groundwork for stronger, more meaningful connections, guided by a sense of calm that stands firm against the storms of conflict. Now turning to the art of letting go, we will explore how embracing this stoic principle can transform our approach to the need for external validation. Moving forward, let's delve into the art of letting go, a key stoic practice that involves releasing things beyond our control. In relationships, this principle is transformative. It teaches us to release the constant need for attention and approval, focusing instead on what truly lies within our power, our thoughts, actions and responses. Imagine a leaf carried by the wind, gently swaying without resistance. It doesn't cling to branches or try to change its course. This imagery encapsulates the essence of letting go, a freedom that emerges from acceptance and understanding that not all aspects of life are within our grasp. To integrate this practice into your daily life, consider engaging in an exercise of mental decluttering. Begin by identifying elements in your life that you cannot change, such as the reactions or perceptions of others. Write them down and consciously acknowledge that these are outside your realm of influence. Next, practice visualization techniques where you imagine gently releasing these concerns, much like letting a balloon drift into the sky. This mental exercise serves as a reminder of the peace that comes with detachment. Reflect on personal aspirations and commitments, reaffirming the priorities that align with your values. This process of realigning your focus encourages personal growth and resilience as it shifts your attention from seeking validation to nurturing what genuinely matters. By embracing the art of letting go, we adopt a more balanced approach to relationships, enriching our interactions with authenticity and intention. As we carry forward this newfound clarity, we lay the foundation for discovering emotional resilience, preparing us for the lessons in building emotional strength to navigate life's complexities. With the next phase of the journey in sight, we turn our attention to building emotional resilience through the lens of Stoicism. This ancient philosophy offers a profound toolkit for managing life's inevitable challenges, including the feelings of rejection or neglect that can arise in relationships. The essence of stoic resilience lies in understanding that our emotions, while natural, do not have to dictate our responses or our sense of self-worth. By cultivating a mindset that prioritizes our inner values over external reactions, we become better equipped to withstand emotional turbulence and maintain our equilibrium. Take, for instance, the story of Elena, a young professional who found herself consumed by the need for her partner's attention. Constantly seeking reassurance, she frequently felt anxious and undervalued. Through her exploration of Stoicism, Elena began to shift her focus from seeking validation to nurturing her own sense of worth. She embraced practices like journaling to reflect on her thoughts and emotions, allowing her to identify patterns and uncover the roots of her insecurities. By doing so, she realized that her self-worth was not contingent upon her partner's attention, but rather on her own values and actions. Elena also practiced mindful detachment, a stoic technique where one observes feelings without becoming entangled in them. This approach empowered her to witness emotions such as disappointment or longing without letting them consume her. Over time, this practice of mindful observation allowed Elena to develop a resilient core, one that could withstand the ebb and flow of relational dynamics without losing herself in the process. In another instance, consider Martin, who struggled with feelings of neglect when his friends did not reciprocate his efforts to maintain contact. By applying stoic principles, Martin learned to set healthy boundaries and focus on relationships that were mutually supportive. He found strength in the realization that true friendships are not measured by the frequency of interaction, but by the quality and authenticity of the connections shared. This newfound perspective allowed Martin to invest in friendships that truly mattered, 
reducing his emotional dependency on superficial validation. These stories illustrate that by leaning into Stoic teachings, individuals can cultivate an inner strength that rises above external circumstances, fostering a resilient spirit that embraces life's unpredictability. Emotional resilience, therefore, emerges not from avoiding difficult emotions but from the courage to face them with wisdom and composure. As we continue our exploration, we'll see how valuing personal growth over external approval leads to a deeper, more fulfilling sense of self. Now turning to the value of personal growth, Stoicism teaches that true fulfillment arises from within, rather than from the approval of others. By placing emphasis on self-improvement, we cultivate a sense of purpose and stability that is resilient to external opinions or societal pressures. Stoicism urges us to focus on developing virtues such as courage, wisdom, and integrity qualities that are internally driven and do not rely on external validation. As you embark on this journey of personal growth, consider setting goals that align with your intrinsic values rather than those imposed by societal expectations. Engage in self-reflection to understand what truly matters to you, for instance, journaling can be a valuable tool for articulating your thoughts and charting your progress. Additionally, incorporating practices like meditation or mindfulness can help deepen your self-awareness, fostering a sense of peace and clarity in your daily life. The key is to consistently invest in yourself, embracing the idea that personal growth is a lifelong pursuit, not a destination. Through Stoicism's lens, the pursuit of self-improvement becomes a journey of self-discovery, one where real satisfaction is found in personal development rather than the transient praise of others. As we continue, let's explore how this focus on personal growth leads to enhanced self-sufficiency, creating a foundation for healthier relationships. With the next phase of the journey in sight, we delve into the benefit of self-sufficiency, a cornerstone of Stoic philosophy. Embracing emotional independence can transform the way we engage in relationships, fostering connections that are stronger and more genuine. By not relying on others for our sense of worth, we cultivate an inner strength that allows us to maintain balance and clarity, even when faced with challenges. Imagine being able to enjoy companionship without the weight of dependency. This is the essence of stoic self-sufficiency. It's about nurturing a relationship with oneself that is stable and secure. Consider practices like daily affirmations to build self-confidence or setting personal goals that encourage self-reliance. These exercises help in reinforcing the belief that your happiness is within your control. Additionally, embracing solitude from time to time can be a powerful way to develop self-sufficiency. Not only does it provide space for reflection and growth, but it also teaches us to find peace and joy on our own terms. Remember, being self-sufficient doesn't mean isolating oneself from others. It's about developing a strong sense of self that enhances the quality of your interactions and relationships. By adopting self-sufficiency, you lay the groundwork for a life enriched by healthier, more balanced relationships where the need for constant attention is replaced by mutual respect and understanding. As we move forward, let's challenge ourselves to redefine success in relationships through the lens of Stoicism, shifting our focus from seeking approval to nurturing personal integrity and peace. As the next challenge unfolds, we re-examine what it truly means to succeed in relationships from a Stoic perspective. In a world often obsessed with capturing attention and approval, Stoicism offers a refreshing and transformative viewpoint. It invites us to shift focus from external validation to nurturing inner virtues. True success in relationships is not measured by how much attention we garner, but by the integrity, honesty, and personal peace we maintain. Consider the relationships in your life. Are they grounded in genuine understanding and shared values, or are they driven by the need for validation? The Stoic idea of success reframes our goals, focusing on the quality of interactions rather than the quantity of attention received. 
It's about creating relationships that are enriching and balanced, where both parties respect and support each other's personal growth. By embracing this stoic ideal, we pave the way for deeper connections that are built on trust and authenticity. Let's take a moment to envision what relationship success looks like through this lens. It is the quiet confidence that comes from being true to oneself, coupled with the joy of being accepted for who you truly are. It is about finding harmony between self-respect and mutual respect, where the relationship becomes a shared journey of discovery rather than a battleground for attention. As we continue this exploration, let us embrace the concept that success in relationships is about maintaining one's integrity while fostering a supportive and understanding environment. This shift can lead to more fulfilling and lasting connections, guiding us to live a life aligned with our authentic selves. As the next phase of our exploration unfolds, we delve into the stoic acceptance of impermanence, a concept that holds profound implications for our relationships. In Stoicism, the realization that everything is transient helps us understand that trying to hold onto things too tightly often leads to unnecessary pain and frustration. By accepting that relationships, like everything else in life, are subject to change, we start to free ourselves from the fear of loss and the compulsive need for attention. This acceptance doesn't mean that we care any less. Rather, it allows us to cherish our connections while understanding that they will naturally evolve over time. Embracing impermanence encourages us to live more fully in the present moment, appreciating the richness of our relationships without the constant pressure of trying to control their outcome. It helps us focus on nurturing the quality of our interactions rather than clinging to them out of fear. This perspective can transform the way we approach our relationships, shifting our mindset from one of scarcity and anxiety to one of abundance and peace. When we let go of the need to fight for attention, we create a space where genuine love and respect can flourish. This shift not only enriches our relationships, but also enhances our overall sense of well-being, allowing us to move forward with grace and confidence as we embrace the natural ebb and flow of life. Moving forward, let's focus on the stoic emphasis on virtue over pleasure and how this mindset could transform our relationships. In the stoic tradition, virtues such as kindness, honesty, courage, and wisdom are the cornerstones of a meaningful life. Prioritizing these virtues over fleeting pleasures or the need for constant attention can lead to deeper, more fulfilling connections. Imagine a scenario where honesty guides your communication, allowing you to express your needs and boundaries clearly. This doesn't just enhance mutual understanding, but also builds a foundation of trust. Kindness, another fundamental stoic virtue, encourages us to act with empathy and genuine concern for others' well-being. By focusing on kindness rather than selfish desires, we cultivate an environment where everyone feels valued and understood. Courage, too, plays a vital role, empowering us to face challenges and uncertainties in our relationships with strength and resilience. Embracing these virtues means we are not swayed by the superficial pursuit of attention, but are instead rooted in principles that bring lasting satisfaction. When we concentrate on practicing virtues daily, we naturally foster relationships based on respect and integrity. This shift from external validation to internal values enriches our interactions, allowing genuine bonds to flourish and ultimately helping us to lead a life of greater peace and fulfillment. As we progress further into the teachings of Stoicism, we uncover how prioritizing these virtues not only enhances personal relationships, but also nurtures our own growth and contentment. With the next phase of the journey in sight, let's explore the stoic perspective on love, which emphasizes emotional connections devoid of dependency. In Stoicism, love is not about possession or control, but is rooted in genuine appreciation and respect for one another's individuality. This viewpoint encourages us to cherish our bonds without the need to constantly seek validation or attention. 
Imagine sharing a relationship where both partners freely express themselves, unburdened by the anxiety of seeking approval. This approach fosters a space where love thrives on mutual growth and understanding, rather than being stifled by insecurity or neediness. By embracing a stoic outlook, we learn to value the connection for what it truly is, a partnership based on mutual respect and a shared journey toward personal development. This alignment of love with inner values rather than external needs allows us to experience relationships more fully and authentically. It helps us appreciate the present moment with our loved ones and encourages us to support each other's paths to personal growth. Through this lens, we find that love, when free from the constraints of dependency, not only becomes a profound source of joy, but also a guiding force in nurturing a healthier, more satisfying relationship. As we continue to weave these stoic principles into our lives, they invite us to redefine our connections, ensuring that love remains a source of strength and harmony, not a battle for attention. Now turning to mindful communication, we recognize its crucial role in nurturing relationships where attention isn't a battleground, Stoicism offers profound insights into how we express and exchange thoughts, encouraging us to communicate with clarity, calmness, and purpose. This philosophy reminds us of the importance of understanding and articulating our own emotions before responding to others. Imagine a scenario where two individuals interact not with hastiness or judgment, but with patience and open-mindedness. By practicing mindful communication, we reduce the likelihood of misunderstandings and conflicts as both parties feel heard and valued. To enhance these skills, we might start by listening actively, focusing on truly understanding the other person's perspective without immediately forming our own response. Additionally, it helps to pause before speaking, reflecting on whether our words align with our values and intentions. This pause is a powerful tool. It allows us to respond thoughtfully rather than react impulsively. Another effective technique is to express ourselves with honesty and kindness, ensuring our communication fosters connection rather than division. Furthermore, asking clarifying questions can prevent assumptions and encourage a clearer exchange. Through these strategies, we build a space where dialogue serves as a bridge to mutual respect and appreciation reducing the stress of unmet needs for attention. By incorporating these practices into our daily interactions, Stoicism guides us to communicate with empathy and integrity, enriching our relationships with authenticity and harmony. Moving forward to the concept of facing rejection gracefully, Stoicism provides us with a profound framework to handle such experiences without resentment. Rejection is an inevitable part of life, be it in personal relationships, job applications, or creative pursuits. Instead of allowing rejection to lead to bitterness or self-doubt, Stoicism encourages us to perceive it as an integral component of the human experience, reminding us that no event is inherently good or bad, it is our perception that colors it. Imagine a scenario where someone faces rejection from a desired job, a stoic perspective would urge them to reflect on the situation objectively, recognizing that while the outcome is not what they hoped for, it does not define their worth or potential. This mindset empowers individuals to accept the situation without undue emotional turmoil, seeing it as an opportunity for growth and resilience. For example, Marcus Aurelius, one of the key stoic philosophers, often wrote about embracing every circumstance as a chance to practice virtue, such as patience and humility. By viewing rejection through this lens, we learn to detach our self-worth from external outcomes, focusing instead on our response and learning process. One effective practice is reframing rejection not as a failure, but as a step in a larger journey toward personal and professional development. This approach not only reduces the sting of rejection, but also fosters a sense of peace and acceptance. Another helpful technique is to express gratitude for the experience itself, recognizing that every rejection teaches us something about our desires, strengths, and areas for improvement. By carrying these stoic principles into our daily lives, 
we cultivate a mindset that views rejection as a natural and essential aspect of existence, allowing us to move forward with grace and renewed determination. With the next phase of the journey in sight, we delve into the concept of developing inner peace through Stoic practices. In a world where external factors often dictate our happiness, Stoicism offers a pathway to cultivate tranquility that is independent of outside circumstances, including the pursuit of attention. One of the core tenets of Stoicism is understanding that serenity comes from within, not from external validations or achievements. This philosophy teaches us to focus on what is within our control, our thoughts, judgments, and actions, while letting go of what is not, such as others' opinions or behaviors. To cultivate inner peace, daily practices can play a significant role. Starting each day with a moment of reflection or meditation can set a peaceful tone for the hours ahead. Engage in mindful breathing exercises to anchor yourself in the present, reducing stress and anxiety. Another effective practice is journaling your thoughts and feelings, allowing you to process emotions without judgment and gain clarity on what truly matters. Gratitude exercises where you list things you are thankful for can shift your focus from what is lacking to what is abundant in your life. Moreover, at the end of each day, take a few minutes to review how you responded to life's challenges. Did you maintain calm and control, or were there moments you let external events dictate your state of mind? This introspection is not for self-criticism but for growth and understanding. By consistently applying these stoic practices, you create a solid foundation of inner peace that is less shaken by the whims of external circumstances. As we continue to explore these ideas, remember that true peace is not the absence of challenges but the ability to remain composed in their presence. This inner calm not only enhances personal well-being but also improves relationships by reducing the need for validation and attention from others, allowing for more authentic and sincere connections. Now turning to the destructive cycle of neediness, we see how this behavior can lead to significant stress and conflict in relationships. Neediness often stems from a deep-seated desire for constant reassurance and attention, which can overwhelm a partner and create an imbalance in the relationship. This imbalance can manifest as dependency, where one partner relies excessively on the other for emotional fulfillment. Such dynamics can strain the relationship, leading to misunderstandings and resentment. Stoicism offers insightful wisdom to address this issue by promoting a healthier way of interacting with others. At its core, Stoic philosophy encourages us to focus on self-reliance and internal strength. By cultivating an appreciation for solitude and personal growth, individuals can meet their emotional needs from within, reducing the pressure on their relationships. Stoicism teaches us to embrace our own company, valuing moments of silence and reflection. This not only helps in overcoming neediness, but also in identifying and understanding our genuine desires and values. By concentrating on personal development and self-sufficiency through practices like self-reflection, we can transform our approach to relationships. This shift allows us to interact with others from a place of wholeness rather than lack. Healthy interaction models, as suggested by Stoic principles, involve setting clear boundaries, practicing active listening without the need for constant reciprocal attention, and recognizing the importance of mutual respect and independence. These practices foster an environment where both partners can thrive individually and collectively, facilitating more balanced and harmonious relationships. As we navigate through these insights, remember that addressing neediness is not about eliminating our need for connection, but nurturing a relationship where both individuals contribute equally to the partnership without being driven by insecurities. Moving forward, we delve into the stoic appreciation of solitude, which serves as a powerful tool for self-discovery and personal growth. In our fast-paced lives, it's easy to overlook the value of spending time alone, yet it is within these moments of solitude that we can truly connect with ourselves. 
By embracing solitude, we gain clarity about our own desires, strengths, and values, which is essential for genuine self-improvement. This deeper understanding reduces our dependence on external validation and the need for others' attention. Solitude offers us the space to explore new interests and hobbies, an opportunity to nurture our creativity and expand our horizons. Whether it's picking up a book, learning a musical instrument, or meditating in silence, these activities foster a sense of fulfillment and joy that emanates from within. They cultivate independence and are aligned with stoic ideals of self-sufficiency. As we engage in these solitary pursuits, we become more attuned to our inner world, leading to a more balanced and harmonious relationship with ourselves and others. Embracing solitude doesn't mean isolating ourselves. Instead, it empowers us to step into social interactions from a place of strength and self-awareness. By cherishing our own company and nurturing our passions, we create a foundation for life that is rich with personal meaning and less reliant on the fleeting nature of external attention. This self-discovery journey through solitude is a gift that keeps giving, fostering resilience and a deeper sense of purpose. Now turning to the importance of setting healthy boundaries, we explore how Stoicism supports this essential aspect of relationships. Stoicism teaches us to prioritize our inner peace and personal values, which naturally leads to establishing clear limits in our interactions with others. Healthy boundaries are not barriers, but rather guidelines that help us protect our emotional and mental well-being. By setting these boundaries, we guard ourselves against becoming overly reliant on others for validation or happiness, fostering a sense of self-respect and mutual respect in our relationships. Stoic wisdom advises us to remain true to our values and principles, which acts as a foundation for maintaining these boundaries. When we honor our own needs and communicate them effectively, we create an environment where relationships can thrive without the pressure of constant attention. This practice not only strengthens our self-sufficiency, but also allows us to engage in relationships that are based on genuine connection rather than dependency. By understanding and implementing healthy boundaries, we cultivate an atmosphere of respect and understanding which is vital for nurturing fulfilling and balanced relationships. Through this, Stoicism guides us to focus on what is within our control and encourages us to let go of the need for external validation, leading to more harmonious interactions. This journey of setting healthy boundaries is a step toward achieving personal freedom and maintaining the integrity of our inner peace while still engaging meaningfully with others. As the next challenge unfolds, we delve into the role of rational thinking, a cornerstone of Stoic philosophy. Rational thinking empowers us to assess situations with clarity and objectivity, a skill crucial when navigating relationships. Imagine a scenario where you feel neglected or ignored. Instead of letting emotions take over, Stoicism teaches us to pause and analyze the situation using reason. This approach helps us differentiate between what is within our control and what is not. By applying rational thought, we reduce the tendency to react emotionally to perceived slights or neglect. Stoic wisdom encourages us to step back and view situations from a broader perspective, weighing facts over feelings. This rational evaluation not only prevents misunderstandings but also guides us to make more informed decisions, fostering healthier interactions. Through rational thinking, we learn to focus on the reality of circumstances rather than subjective interpretations, easing emotional burdens and leading to more balanced, fulfilling relationships. Now turning to the transformative power of acceptance, we find a core stoic belief that redefines how we engage with life's challenges. Acceptance is more than passive acknowledgement. It's an active embrace of reality, allowing us to navigate relationships with grace and resilience. Consider situations where expectations aren't met or desires go unfulfilled. Stoicism encourages us to accept what is beyond our control, relieving the pressure of unmet needs and soothing the tensions that arise. This practice doesn't mean we become indifferent. 
Instead, it empowers us to shift our focus towards what we can influence, such as our responses and attitudes. Acceptance transforms our interactions by reducing unnecessary conflict and fostering a sense of peace. It teaches us to stop resisting the inevitable changes in relationships, thereby cultivating a deeper understanding and compassion towards ourselves and others. Through acceptance, we learn to value experiences for what they are rather than what we wish them to be, leading to more genuine connections. Embracing this stoic principle helps us release the grip on perfection and control, replacing it with a balanced, realistic approach to love and friendship, paving the way for healthier, more sustainable relationships. With acceptance as our guide, we prepare to journey further into the realm of stoic virtues. Moving forward, we delve into the role of empathy and understanding within stoic philosophy both of which are pivotal for nurturing meaningful relationships. Stoicism teaches us to see beyond our own immediate desires and perspectives, encouraging a deep compassion for others. This isn't about suppressing our needs, but rather understanding that every person has their own struggles and aspirations. A core Stoic exercise is the practice of putting ourselves in another's position. Imagine how this changes the dynamics of a relationship where there could have been conflict over unmet attention needs, there is instead a space of empathy and patience. This perspective shift fosters a stronger connection, replacing frustration with compassion. Empathy allows us to communicate more openly and honestly, reducing misunderstandings that often arise from seeking validation. By recognizing that attention from others doesn't define our worth, we embrace a balanced view that values mutual respect and understanding. As we cultivate empathy, we elevate our relationships beyond superficial exchanges to create bonds grounded in genuine care and mutual growth. Understanding becomes a bridge that connects us across differences, allowing us to support each other without the pressure of seeking validation. Through the lens of Stoicism, Empathy is not just a feeling but a deliberate practice that significantly enhances our interactions, paving the way for relationships defined by harmony and mutual respect. Acknowledging the power of empathy and understanding, we turn our gaze to the broader concept of living in accordance with nature, which invites further exploration of maintaining harmony without the constant need for attention. As the next phase of the journey unfolds, we delve into the stoic principle of living in accordance with nature. This idea might sound abstract at first, but it's quite straightforward when applied to relationships. Living in accordance with nature simply means aligning ourselves with the natural order, embracing what is within our control and letting go of the rest. In relationships, this translates to understanding that we can't control or demand another person's attention or affection. Instead, we focus on what we can manage our own actions and responses. By doing so, we create harmony rather than conflict. Imagine a relationship where each person respects the other's space and independence, allowing affection to flourish naturally rather than attempting to force it. This approach reduces tension and fosters a peaceful coexistence. When we accept the ebb and flow of emotions and interactions as part of life's natural rhythm, we relinquish the futile struggle for constant validation. This practice of harmonizing with nature doesn't mean passive resignation but active acceptance of reality, freeing us from unnecessary stress. It encourages us to appreciate and nurture the connections we have by focusing on mutual respect and shared values. Embracing this stoic wisdom allows relationships to blossom in their own time, grounded in patience and understanding, and it transforms the way we relate to one another, shifting away from competition for attention towards a serene, balanced partnership. Moving forward, let's delve into how Stoicism illuminates the path to joy through simplicity. In today's world, we often find ourselves tangled in complex situations, striving for external validation that never truly satisfies our inner yearning for contentment. Here, Stoicism offers a refreshing perspective finding fulfillment in the simplicity of life itself. 
Imagine the freedom that comes when we resist the impulse to seek approval and instead cherish the simple pleasures that surround us. This might mean savoring a quiet moment with a loved one, appreciating the beauty of a serene landscape, or simply taking a few deep breaths to center ourselves. By focusing on these straightforward joys, we not only mitigate the stress that comes from chasing after unattainable desires, but also enhance our well-being. Simplicity invites us to live authentically, to revel in what we have rather than lamenting what we lack. Stoicism teaches that happiness doesn't demand elaborate achievements or constant recognition from others. Instead, it thrives in the space where we accept things as they are and find gratitude in every small victory and humble moment. Such simplicity is a profound form of strength that liberates us from the burdens of neediness and allows our genuine selves to shine. As we embrace this Stoic philosophy, we cultivate a life that is not only richer in joy but also unencumbered by the complications of insatiable validation. Through simplicity, we nurture inner peace and a deeper connection to what truly matters. As the next chapter unfolds, we delve into the advantage of emotional detachment, a powerful Stoic principle that can significantly enhance our relationships. Emotional detachment doesn't mean becoming cold or indifferent, but rather adopting a mindset that allows us to navigate interactions without the constant need for approval or attention. By practicing this form of detachment, we shift our focus from endlessly yearning for validation to fostering genuine connections based on respect and mutual understanding. Consider how relationships often become strained when one party is heavily reliant on the other's approval. Emotional detachment offers a remedy by encouraging us to maintain a sense of self-worth independent of external affirmation. This approach cultivates resilience and allows us to engage with others from a place of strength rather than vulnerability. It frees us from the emotional roller coaster driven by the highs and lows of praise or criticism, leading to more balanced and harmonious interactions. In essence, emotional detachment empowers us to appreciate relationships for the intrinsic joy they bring, rather than as a means to fill an internal void. As we adopt this stoic wisdom, we foster healthier dynamics where connections are nurtured by authenticity and personal integrity, not overshadowed by the compulsive pull of attention-seeking. This transformation not only enriches our interactions but also reinforces our own emotional stability, paving the way for deeper, more meaningful bonds. Through emotional detachment, we find the space to love freely and interact with grace, unhindered by the expectations and pressures of seeking constant validation. With the next phase of the journey in sight, we explore the stoic principle of embracing change and its profound impact on our relationships. Stoicism teaches us that change is an inevitable part of life relationships evolve, situations shift, and expectations often go unmet. By accepting this inherent fluidity, we develop a mindset that is adaptable and resilient, paving the way for healthier interactions and reducing the strain caused by rigid expectations. Imagine a relationship where both individuals cling tightly to a fixed idea of how things should be. This inflexibility can lead to frustration and disappointment when life naturally veers off course. On the other hand, embracing change allows us to go with the flow, adjusting to circumstances as they unfold. This openness to change not only lowers our stress levels, but also fosters an environment where growth is possible, both individually and together. When we accept that nothing is permanent, we free ourselves from the pressure of trying to control every outcome, making space for genuine connection. We learn to appreciate the present moment, valuing our relationships for what they are right now, rather than what we think they should be. This acceptance transforms our approach to love and companionship, encouraging us to engage with more empathy and understanding. By embracing change, we navigate the complexities of human connection with grace, allowing our relationships to flourish in a landscape where expectations are flexible and love is resilient. 
This mindset shift not only enhances our bonds with others, but also strengthens our inner peace, enriching our lives with a sense of calm and acceptance that is at the very heart of Stoic philosophy. As we transition to the practical side of our journey with Stoicism, let's explore applying its profound teachings in our daily lives. Imagine starting your day with a moment of reflection, asking yourself what truly matters. This simple exercise helps realign your focus with internal values rather than external validation. As you go about your day, practice observing your responses to challenging situations. When faced with frustration or disappointment, pause and reflect on what lies within your control. By consciously choosing your response, you exercise the stoic principle of rational thinking. Consider keeping a daily journal where you jot down moments when you felt the urge for validation. Reflecting on these entries allows you to recognize patterns and triggers, gradually shifting your perspective inward. Another practical exercise is to set specific times during the day to practice gratitude, acknowledging what you have rather than what you lack. This reinforces the stoic teaching of valuing what is within your grasp. Finally, engage in simple mindfulness practices such as deep breathing or a short meditation to center yourself. These exercises not only ground you but also cultivate patience and self-control. By integrating these practices into your routine, you nurture a mindset that thrives on self-awareness and self-sufficiency. This shift from seeking external affirmation to internal contentment is a cornerstone of stoic living, empowering you to navigate life with greater peace and resilience. With the next phase of the journey in sight, let's delve into real-life examples of individuals who embraced stoicism to rise above the yearning for others' attention. Consider the story of Sarah, a young professional navigating the corporate world's demands. Initially, Sarah struggled with the constant need for recognition from her peers and superiors, which often left her feeling anxious and unfulfilled. Curious about Stoicism, she began incorporating its teachings into her life. By focusing on internal values and what lay within her control, Sarah shifted her perspective. She started keeping a journal, noting moments where her need for external validation was strongest. Over time, this practice illuminated patterns and empowered her to respond to challenges with composure. Sarah found that her work improved as she concentrated on her own growth rather than seeking approval. Her newfound sense of self-control and patience allowed her to thrive in work relationships, leading to genuine connections and opportunities for advancement. Another case is that of Michael, an artist who often felt trapped by the need for external praise for his creations. After being introduced to Stoic philosophy, Michael chose to focus on the joy of the creative process itself. Emphasizing intrinsic satisfaction over external accolades, he found a renewed passion and freedom in his art. By practicing gratitude for the ability to create, Michael let go of the fear of rejection, resulting in more authentic and fulfilling artistic expressions. These stories highlight how internal transformation through Stoicism can lead to profound changes, helping individuals find joy and fulfillment from within, irrespective of external factors. With the next chapter drawing to a close, let's summarize how Stoicism can reshape our approach to relationships, making them healthier and more fulfilling. By embracing Stoic principles, we learn to shift focus from seeking attention to nurturing our inner strength. This journey of inner development empowers us to cultivate meaningful connections grounded in authenticity rather than the fleeting pursuit of validation. Remember, the key insights from Stoicism we've explored emphasize the importance of self-control, patience, internal focus, and emotional resilience. These elements equip us to face relational challenges with grace and composure, helping us to maintain our integrity and peace of mind. As you reflect on your own relationships, consider how these Stoic teachings might guide you towards personal growth and deeper connections. If these insights resonate with you, share your thoughts in the comments below and subscribe to our channel for more enlightening content. 
Keep this philosophy in your heart as you navigate your relationships, always aiming for genuine connection over superficial attention. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the wisdom of Stoicism.